All new tonight, we're introducing you to an Atlanta man who is one of the longest kidney transplant survivors in the United States. So at the age of 18, Steve Owens was playing football for Auburn University. He was diagnosed with an incurable disease. And it was fatherly love that saved Steve's life. Steve's father is the one who donated his kidney two years after the diagnosis. Steve became one of the first successful transplants at Emory Healthcare back in 1972. But now, 50 years later, Steve is on the search for a new kidney as the one from his father is beginning to fail. Steve says he has a lot to live for, including watching his grandchildren grow up. I want to, if I can, to get back to the point where I can now take my uh, uh, grandson bird hunting, uh, if I can take them hiking along the Appalachian Trail like I used to love to do, uh, or just go hang out in the woods. And uh, just, you know, that's, that's my happy place. Just last week, the whole family celebrated 50 years of that successful transplant mm. at the happiest place on earth, mm. Disney World. So we are certainly rooting for Steve and hoping that he finds that kidney. Wishing needs. him the best, absolutely.